So antibiotic stewardship is really making sure that each patient gets the best treatment for their illness. And that means that when a patient needs an antibiotic, that they get it in a timely manner, they get the right drug, the right dose, and the right duration. And it also means that if a patient doesn't need an antibiotic, they don't receive it unnecessarily. What we, what we are trying to do with antibiotic stewardship programs is make sure that each and every facility has an, an antibiotic stewardship program. And that can either be um, a small team of individuals working together. Ideally, it's a multidisciplinary team from throughout the, the hospital representing different disciplines like nursing, pharmacy, uh, physicians, infectious diseases, sometimes critical care as well. And if all those resources are available, ideally those people are coming together to develop policies to, ha to improve how antibiotics are being used. One thing I wanna mention, um, and this is really kind of getting at your question about what antibiotic stewardship is not. Antibiotic stewardship is all about improving how we're using antibiotics, optimizing antibiotic use. One perception is that it's all about taking away antibiotics. We also want to make sure that antibiotic stewardship programs, may, in, in certain circumstances when the patient is really sick and needs an antibiotic right away, that that patient gets that antibiotic as soon as possible. Um, and obviously that they're getting the right antibiotic treatment, especially a sepsis patient, a patient who um, is critically ill. So the perception that it's all about taking away is, is not necessarily true. It's not about just taking away antibiotics. It's about making sure that the patient is getting the best treatment for their illness.